Have you ever wondered how to cook dandelion? This humble weed, often overlooked and underappreciated, hides a secret bounty of benefits and flavors. Today, we delve into the world of this vibrant yellow flower, transforming it from a common garden nuisance into a delicious and nutritious culinary delight. For anyone unfamiliar with the dandelion, it's a perennial plant with bright yellow flowers. Every part of this plant, from its radiant petals to its deep-rooted tubers, is edible. It's packed with vitamins A, C, and K, and it's a good source of calcium, potassium, iron, and manganese. And the best part, it's probably growing in your backyard right now. Before we begin, remember, only harvest dandelions from areas that haven't been sprayed with pesticides or other chemicals. Safety first, always. Now, onto the cooking process. First things first, gather the dandelions. You want to pick the young leaves, as they are less bitter than the mature ones. Rinse them thoroughly under running water to remove any dirt or insects. Next, blanch the leaves. This process involves dropping them into boiling water for about a minute, then immediately plunging them into ice water. Blanching helps reduce the bitterness and makes the leaves more palatable. Once blanched, it's time to saute the leaves. Heat a pan with a drizzle of olive oil. Add some minced garlic and cook until it's golden and fragrant. Then, toss in the blanched dandelion leaves. Stir them around in the pan, allowing them to soak up the flavors of the garlic and oil. The dandelions are ready when they've wilted down and become tender, which should only take about five minutes. Season them with a pinch of salt and a squeeze of fresh lemon juice for a bright tangy finish. Now what about those sunny yellow flowers? They can be eaten raw in salads, but they also make a fantastic fritter. To prepare, mix a simple batter of flour, water, and seasoning. Dip each flour into the batter, then fry them in hot oil until they're crispy and golden. The result is a delightful snack that's crunchy on the outside, soft and slightly sweet on the inside. So to summarize, cooking dandelions involves a few simple steps. Harvesting, washing, blanching, and sautéing the leaves, and battering and frying the flowers. Remember to only pick dandelions from areas free of chemicals, and always wash them thoroughly. From overlooked weed to a star ingredient in your kitchen, dandelions are a testament to nature's bounty. Next time you see these yellow flowers dotting your lawn, consider giving them a second chance. You might just discover your new favorite ingredient. 